We're back. We are back after a little bit of a break. <laughs> Thanks to everybody who's recently subscribed. I'm Rich. And I'm Fran. We've had lots of new subscribers to our channel while we've been away, so thank you very much. And welcome back to everybody who knows us. Um, we've uh, been hanging around in this spot now for a week, and we were hanging around before for a week or so. Um, we're waiting for the lock to open, which apparently opened up this morning, Fran. We've had a walk down there and spoken to the lovely guys that have been working hard. The new gates are on and they've promised us that it's open now. So we're hoping to be the first ones through the lock with the brand new gates on. Um, it's a little bit nerve wracking because I really don't want to be bumping <laughs> into brand new gates. So um, yeah, that's it. But we're off for a cruise shortly. So if you're not familiar with the UK canal system, every winter they close certain sections of the system down so they can do essential repairs and that's what we've been waiting for here. So dinner's in the fire, we're going to uh, have a cruise for a while and then stop and um, relax again and uh, just do what we normally do, which yeah. is not a lot. Not a lot. Well, I don't know. Winter time, it's dark early, so the board games are out. The weaving is going crazy at the moment. I'm really busy. Um, I've got a busy weekend because Rich is actually leaving me on my own this weekend. I'm apparently walking up Mount Snowdon in <laughs> Wales with my brothers this weekend, uh, but the weather isn't looking too good. It's uh, predicted snow and high winds and uh, a chill factor of minus 14 centigrade. So that'll be fun, but who cares? We'll, we'll either do it or we won't do it. <laughs> I think they'll find a pub otherwise. <laughs> and meanwhile, I'm looking after the boat and I'll be, I will be weaving loads. So look out for the shop if you um, if you haven't seen it. Um, I think that's it, isn't it? We'll yeah. get cruising, get to our next spot because we're going to be there for a few weeks afterwards. There's another closure about 13 miles ahead and we're going to have to sit on one little track for a few weeks. But we've got plenty to do and plenty to show you, so don't worry. Right, let's do it then. Come on then. Here we are, this is Varney's Lock, just north of Cropredy on the Oxford Canal. Something we forgot to tell you earlier on where we were. But it's had two brand new gates fitted and apparently at the cost of somewhere like £120,000. So you can imagine just how much it costs to maintain the whole system given the fact that there are thousands of locks and two and a half thousand miles of canal to upkeep. Behind me in the field you can see a fantastic example of ridge and furrow farming dating back to medieval times where each farmer was responsible for his own strip of land and uh, can, carried on that way until the 17th century when the land was cleared, farmers removed, villages demolished to give way to grazing. the lovely guys from Three Element Canvas Company that have come to fit a pram cover for us. We're not having a crutch cover at the front just because we've wanted the front of the boat to be open but we did think we needed this and we are so excited.
well, we love a freebie. And uh, nothing more than we like is to find a nice chunk of wood for the fire in the morning. And uh, we've been collecting kindling as well. We haven't bought any kindling this year at all. It's all been foraged. And it's, uh, yeah, we dry it one day, use it the next. And it's been brilliant. So let's get back to this snuggly little boat of ours then, shall we? Hot chocolate. Hot chocolate, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where have we been? It's solstice, it's the 21st of December and uh, it's our special day of the year and we're just going to have some fun today, have some wine, eat some goodies, watch some rubbish and just gen generally just watch the day unfold. We actually made an executive decision this morning and decided it was going to be present day rather than wait until Christmas day. <laughs> <laughs> so we've even had our presents this morning. Just because we, I don't know, this just seems like such an important day. I don't know why this isn't the end and the beginning of the year. But um, to me it is. To me this is the, the lowest, darkest point of the year. And everything is good from now on. Yeah, so. yeah, we really love this day. And uh, talking of presents, look at this. Look <laughs> at my presents. Paul McCartney's lyrics, the lyrics wrote all the lyrics he's ever written and meanings behind them so that's going to be fantastic reading coming up and i can't show you mine yet because it's under a pile of stuff over there but i will show you it's an absolutely fabulous book and this lovely jumper so yeah we're gonna have a lovely day yeah it's gonna be great so where have we been well since we last uh, spoke with you we were on the grand union leicester arm coming up through um foxton locks yeah. Since then we've come down the Grand Union onto the Oxford Canal and we're almost now at Oxford so it's a distance probably of some 50-60 miles we've travelled since then. But it's taken us ages because there's been lot of closures and we've had to wait around and obviously we've been up and down to see family over the last few weeks so it's taken us a while but um, and we're yet to actually get into Oxford, I think that might be tomorrow. Yeah, I take a bus or a train into Oxford and... Uh... We're hanging around here for a bit, so we're going to go into Oxford, get our shopping, do Christmas, and then we will go back and film Oxford, hopefully, just after... As long as we're not locked down, we'll go back and film Oxford. But... Yeah, so that's uh, going to be interesting, because the last time we were here, we didn't spend much time in Oxford, did we? We no. just uh, didn't do any no. of the touristy things, really, so no. we're going to swat up and watch to see and do and uh, take you along with us. Yeah. So we'll be back on with regular videos from now on uh, after the new year and um, heading out of Oxford back up the Oxford Canal through Banbury to the Midlands and then as we head further north it's been a lovely see canal actually this it's really old it's very unchanged Banbury has really been changed but the old boatyard has mm. still been there and we have filmed that before but the canal generally has not been manicured it's very rough and ready and there's little river sections and it's quite wild it's and we really like it. Really twisty and turny, it isn't is. it? It's really yeah. a convoluted system. But we've obviously... stopped banging the table. <laughs> we've, yeah, see, I'm sitting on my hands. We've obviously not been um, in the mood for filming on the way down, but we knew we'd be going back. And again, there's a lockage... I don't know, a lock, a lockage, a lockage, lockage stoppage. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know, about 10, 15 miles that way, which we can't get past Back. until I think the end of February. So we've got plenty of time now to film and it's going to be good. Yeah, so let's hope for a few snowy days. That'd yeah. be lovely, won't it? Yeah. So that's it. That's all we've got to say for ourselves. Um, we've had a difficult time with my best friend Steve passing away and... Uh, it's not been easy for both of us it's just been terrible 30 years of friendship and just gone especially this time of year when everybody's at a low point anyway but yeah. as i say you know now is the time to get back on it if we can yeah. and yeah. 
bless you, Steve. Anyway, so all that's left to say is a Merry Christmas to you all. Yes, and thank you for sticking with us. Thank you for hanging around while we've been AWOL. Um, really appreciate it and really appreciate it. all the messages of sympathy that we've had from everybody, hundreds and hundreds. Um, but yeah, with that said, have a lovely Christmas. And a good new year. And uh, let's hope next year it will be better than this one. And we said that last year as well. <laughs> so uh, anyway, happy new year to you all. And we'll see you out there on the other side. Okay. See you soon. Ta-ra.